This is the 40th anniversary of D-Day, spoken by Ronald Reagan. These are the boys of Point du Hoc. These are the men who took the cliffs. These are the champions who helped free a continent. These are the heroes who helped end a war. Gentlemen, I look at you and I think of the words of Stephen Spender's poem. You are men who, in your life's fought for life and left the vivid air signed with your honor. Forty summers have passed since the battle you fought here. You were young the day you took the cliffs. Some of you hardly more than boys, with the deepest joys of life still before you. Yet you risked everything here. Why? Why did you do it? What impelled you to put aside the instinct of self-preservation and risk your life to take these cliffs? What inspired the groups of men of armies that met here? Gentlemen, I, we look at you and somehow we know the answer. It was faith and belief. It was loyalty and love. The men of Normandy had faith that what they were doing is right, had faith that they fought for all humanity, had faith that a just God will grant them mercy on this beachhead or the next. That is the deep knowledge, and pray God we have not lost it, for it is a, there is a profound moral difference between the use of force for liberation and between the use of force for conquest. You are here to liberate, not to conquer, and so you and your men did not doubt yourselves. You were right not to doubt.